ready. Green, green, green. On your right side. Green, middle, or green, white. Still there. Hold your line. Clear left. Hi all. This is Mike from Wanderschikan TV. After a few videos about setting up OpenXR for virtual reality in racing simulators, today we will come to the topic of better immersion into the simulation. The basic concept of improving the immersion was uh, posted by one of my viewers, Kulpas1984, on my channel as a comment to my recent iRacing video um, about using OpenXR for that simulation. It is applicable to a number of simulators like Assetto Corsa Competizione, which you can see in the video in the background, Assetto Corsa, iRacing, R-Factor 2, Automobilista 2 and Dirt Rally 2. The concept may also work in other simulators running in OpenXR like for example Formula 1 2022. However, I couldn't test that simulator yet. Also it's applicable not only to racing simulators, but also to flight simulators like Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 and DCS World. As a first condition to make use of that effect, please make sure that your simulator runs in OpenXR. You can follow the other videos on my channel on how to set up your favorite simulator accordingly. If you like my video and you would like to further support my work on virtual reality for racing simulators and similar games, please give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. The actual adaption within the games is quite easy. After you have set up everything, including OpenXR Toolkit, make sure to enter the configuration menu of OpenXR Toolkit by pressing Ctrl F2. Inside that one, navigate to the Appearance tab and you will find an option which is called World Scale. By default, this option is set to 100% or 60.0 mm. Set this value now to 120% of 50 mm. This is a good starting point for Assetto Corsa Competizione, Assetto Corsa, Dirt Rally or Automobilista 2. Flight simulators may even require higher values. Suggestion of Kuipas um, 1984 was 160%. But anyhow, in the end, you can adjust the settings to your liking and your feeling. You will probably need a bit of time for adaption of your eyes to the new settings. Um, this requires re-judging of distances, for example. However, after some few laps, you will notice that the immersion feeling is much better than just running the whole thing at 100%. That's already it. A very easy and fast fix for a better racing feeling in virtual reality. I hope you enjoyed the content of the video. I want to thank you for your attention and say goodbye until the next time. And see you on track.